Science. Anywhere from 40,000 to 220,000 people die in Europe from flu each year. Some 10% of adults may catch it. Most people shake it off after a few weeks, but it can be more dangerous for elderly people because as we get older, our immune systems tend to weaken. Bonjour. Vaccines against seasonal flu have been around for some time. Now pharmaceutical firm Sanofi Pasteur has designed a less invasive version of the flu shot. The vaccine's injected into the skin rather than the muscle. The needle's just one and a half millimetres long, ten times shorter than normal. It's a pre-filled syringe and the needle allows the vaccination to be delivered into the dermal skin layer, the right dose each time. But why deliver a vaccine into the skin? The body protects itself from infections and disease with its immune system, and the skin is a key component of that. As we age, our immune systems become less effective. This waning of the immune system negatively affects the body's ability to fight infectious diseases and how effective vaccinations are. After passing through the top layer of skin, the epidermis, the new vaccine reaches the second layer of skin, the dermis. This layer is rich in immune cells. These cells play an important role in stimulating and regulating the immune system, preventing infections such as flu. These special skin cells are the target of the vaccine because of their ability to stimulate the production of antibodies. The vaccines produced in a complex near Lyon in France, created in 1917 by Marcel Merrier, an assistant of Louis Pasteur. It's one of the biggest vaccine production factories in the world. In this laboratory, protected by imposing security measures, the containers of vaccine produced are checked one by one. The capacity of quality control here is 18,000 syringes per hour. Anyone who enters the lab must wear protective clothing. This production line has 17 cameras which visually check the vaccines. Can using too many vaccines weaken our capacity to protect ourselves against illness? Not at all. The vaccine trains our immune systems to respond to aggressive infections, and after each vaccination we're stronger, we respond more quickly, we're more able to fight off infections. If we take too many medicines, don't we risk that the vaccine will be another on top, adding to all the other medications we already take? Vaccinations are different to medication. A vaccine is an act of prevention which is destined to prevent specific infectious illnesses. With one or two injections, you're protected for months, even years against infectious illnesses. Unfortunately, the level of pain is about the same for skin as intramuscular jabs. As this is the first flu season where the intradermal injections have been used, researchers will have to wait a few more months to fully judge the results and side effects.